Okay, so this is probably the most presentable I have looked in days. This is what happens when you have a day job and you are dirty. I'll do that, yeah. This, on the other hand, like, God's gonna have to deal. Don't worry, though. We're time traveling today. I'm recording this in the past. Actually, no, I'm not. No. I mean, we are gonna time travel today, but this, this video is actually for today. So, I'm having trouble. For those of you who are new and who don't know who I am, I'm Radio Noir, your resident witch and creatrix over to Radius Hand and Denise Divine, where I create myth, magic, and meaning for your everyday life through art, intuition, and energy work. And on Sundays, I like to do a little thing called my stash cast. So, without further ado, let's get going. Now, uh, a little housekeeping, if you will. Um, I have been making a, uh, an, I just have a thought, I'm make, making an intention, making the intention. I'm safe. I'm, I'm, I'm looking for something. Yeah, I'm just going to have to deal with it. Making the intention. No, fail. It's not in here. I've been looking for this damn thing. Um, and the intention has been. all kinds of weird shit in here. The intention has been to post every single day um, here at Patreon. Now, here's the thing. Y your girl's got content. I got content, content. My content has content. Like, I am not... I am not worried about... I have so many little fun goodies in here. And a butterfly pin. Like, what is this? What are you doing here? You don't belong here. My little friends for the day. We're gonna see how long it takes me to stab myself with that. What the hell is this? Oh, this is specialty. Do you get it? Yeah. I know. I'm sorry. I'm not sorry. I'm not sorry at all. I'm not sorry at all. Anyway. Do any hangers? You know, I'm not supposed to be going through this. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not, but here I am. Totally looking for something else, not finding it. Put it down. Put it down. Alright. <sighs> I'm so excited. So, there's something wrong with me. Oh no, I didn't put all this stuff back. Actually, I shouldn't put any of this back, because, like, like, some of this needs to just go elsewhere. Like, uh, this. 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 Or this. Don't ask what that is. I know what it is. I know exactly what it is. It is, it is uh, loot for work. Not not the current day job. Another one. Um, just like random stuff that would have been like tossed. And I'm a scavenger, fucking vulture. So vulture in a cardigan. <laughs> <laughs> So, okay. All right. We're going to get to it. We're going to get to it. I had a thought. I had a brief thought that maybe what I was looking for in reference to show you was going to be on my desk hiding somewhere. It wasn't. <laughs> it was not. All right. All right. So, um, it's stash. Stash. In the art community, specifically in the fiber community, but really in the textiles community, honestly, and anybody who makes stuff community, right? Stash is the collection of things that you use to make stuff, right? So it's your yarn, it's your beads, buttons, fabric, uh, wool, wood, glass, all kinds of things. And maybe one day I will share my glass stash, but it's not today. Anyway, anyway, um, I like to share my stash because Part of it's to inspire you to say, hey, look, this is what I have. This is what I do with it. If you have this, you could do with this. Or if you're interested in doing this, this is what you might use to do this. Um, and the thing with it is, is that a lot of, um, and I guess this is just a fucking tangent for today. A lot of artists, I mean, not a lot. That's okay. Let's, let's rewind. Showing my age. Although, I mean, is rewinding and fast-forwarding still a thing, even though we don't use VHSs 
Or is it skipping now? Because <laughs> it's CDs and DVDs. I don't fucking know. Friend! Friend help. Friend help. Which, which one is it? Okay, anyway. So, here's the thing with that. Um, I've been trying to uh, do videos and I just, like, I was going somewhere else and now I remember something else and I don't know where I was going originally, so now we're going here. Ooh, shiny. It's fucking ADHD brain at work. And look, always a fun time, though. So anyway, um, housekeeping. I have been trying to do videos. I have been trying, I have been trying, I have been trying, I have been trying. And I don't know what's going on, but it's not working. So, um, as you've noticed, I've been doing a lot of audio lately. Now, here's the thing about me and audio. I, according to some people, apparently have a pleasant voice. I mean, it's not a lie. Okay. I don't particularly like it, but I don't have to. I don't listen to myself anyway, so. But apparently it's pleasing. So audio and I get along real well. Also, I have way less problems with audio. Now, the reason I do video, one, is because um, when I started doing video, Periscope was a thing. YouTube is always and was always going to be the mainstay. Although Vimeo is like awesome too. I like Vimeo. Um, but anyway, neither here nor there. But a lot of people do video. Um, and then, then Facebook Live and Instagram Live, those became things. And here's the thing. The funny thing is when I got into doing video, I was doing periscopes, which is like, I don't even know. Is that a thing anymore? <laughs> I don't know. But the thing about the periscopes is they were always live. They would only stay up for a certain, like, when it started. They would only stay up for, like, I, I don't know, like, 24 hours. And, um, because it was live, you know, that means it was, it was full of whatever the fuck happened. And I do improv in, in, off the cuff and just, like, pulling things in my ass, like, really well. So I can get down with live. Also, I commit to whatever fucking mistakes I make. <laughs> And so some people, they, they want it perfect and polished and lovely and wonderful. And I'm just like, nah, I'm not doing that again. Reasons I'm not an actress, take one. <laughs> seriously. Like, seriously. Anyway. Um, yeah, I've been trying to do these and it's not been working. Now, here's another thing that's happened. Do you notice our setup is a little different? We're vertical. <laughs> Why are we vertical? Because I broke my tripod. Mm -hmm. Broke my tripod. Hella pissed about it. And here's the thing. When you put vertical videos up on like places like YouTube. Uh, what ends up happening. Is. Um, you've got the vertical in the center. And then you've got like the video blown up on the sides. And I find that to be visually distracting. And if I just ruined that for you. Oops. Now, because this whole tripod issue, I was just like, well, well, um, I don't know. I don't fucking know. I don't know. <sighs> Damn it. This is what, this is what, so, and I was like, well, it, I guess you're not going to do videos anymore. I'm like, bitch. Excuse me? Excuse me? I don't think that's how we do things here. So, 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 like, well, you can go back to doing videos like you used to, just doing vertical and just fucking deal with it until you replace your tripod. And I'm like, yeah. And so here we are. Um, reason that's even relevant, right? I, I like to, I like to let y'all know what's going on. I would like to be as transparent as possible as, um, uh, evidenced by my pale as fuck complexion. No, I'm just kidding. Um, I'm a vampire. Cave lizard. That's what's going on. Yeah. Cave lizard. So, 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 so. Stash. Now, like I was saying, stash is usually materials. My stash, however, also includes tools because I'm that bitch. I like to collect tools. And if there's a set of things, or if it comes in multiple colors, ah, uh, compulsively, I want all of them. 
if it comes in multiple sizes, I probably want all of them. And so Sunday is for stash. There you go. So I meant to post this last week. Um, that didn't happen for a lot of reasons. One of them was because I hadn't actually recorded the video. And I had the tiny human in my home. And so noise and like if I had recorded this and then and it said fuck you I'm not doing things I would have been so pissed because I'm usually tense on the weekends yeah 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 so 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 um here's what's happening right um and I've done this a couple times because so this is a an all of them video and then I'm going to do um, a video with each of the different brands over the next hmm, couple of weeks uh, so yeah there we go mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. okay hey my mouse is up here so there's no need to reach over here I'm not gonna do anything okay all right, let's get to the meat and taters. What's well, taters, precious? Oh man, oh man. Who let me on the internet now? Like seriously, whose idea was this? I don't know. So anyway, sorry, I didn't write up. What I've stashed today. <laughs> Pom pom makers. Okay. 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 So this will be the other reason this is a video and I didn't do this as an audio is I was going to show you something on camera. I try to do a video if possible. Now I always have pictures in the description below. And for those of you who are watching this on YouTube, you need to hit the link at the top and it'll send you over to fucking Patreon and then you can watch it there and see the pictures. So yeah, yeah. The nights who say me. Is I like are we in like full nerd mode today? Because it looks like it. Wait a minute. You know you say that like you're not like that all the time. You are. Damn. All right. So anyway, I got all the com I all the pom pom makers. Oh god, that that could have come out bad. Big and gloss over that. Anyway. Um, yeah. So what happened was I found one and then it's like, oh, do you want this size too? Yes, I do. <laughs> and then I was in another store and it's like, hey, we have some too and they're cute. Do you want them? And I'm like, obviously. So pom pom makers. But yeah, I do video when I have something to show you. I do have the pictures though, because I'm usually, <laughs> um, a little too, wobbly wobbly um and it can be hard to like see what's going on and um i don't know how your connection is when you're watching this and sometimes it's hard to watch video to, you know, whatever so i always have pictures so you can see stills and you can see clearly see labels and all that so if you want the thing you can go buy the thing but i also usually have links to if i can find them usually either from the retailer that i went to or a retailer that i know at the time that i post it has them and that's Imperative words at the time that I post it has them and by post it. I mean when I fucking record and drop the, the copy Okay, so um, I think these I think these are the first ones. These are the first ones I bought. I don't know. That's that's probably not even true. So boop. We have the extra large We have the large and the small The extra small these are all by clover and if you don't know anything about yarn and whatnot um, clover makes they make a lot of um, fiber tools. Elenise! Oh my god, look how cute they are! Okay, first of all, first of all, first of all, look. Tiny. I think that's a mouse. Yeah, it's a mouse. We have a dog for the small. Medium is a sheep. Very appropriate. Uh, the large is a bar, and the extra large is um, an elephant. Okay, so yeah. Now, one thing I do want to stress is that my stash cast and my art hauls, which is where I share stuff that I bought for art or collected for art, 
These are not reviews. I do have a section where I focus on those. I haven't done one in a really long time um, because I don't use new things or new to me things terribly often. Um, and my blog posting is extensive, but, but, um, yeah. And if you'd like to know what the hell that means, I'll link, I'll link you. I haven't blogged in a really long time at this time, at this point. Um, but let's see. I'll put a note in there. And this is what we do. We put notes while we're doing stuff. So I got all these. I'm pretty sure I got them between Michael's and AC Moore, but it might've been Joanne. These I found at Target of all fucking places. Okay. So here's the thing. Um, I am, I'm going to tell you right now that I'm linking all of the Clover ones from Joanne because I, I found them at Joanne, like all of them. Um, and I try to not send people like all over the place. Like if there's literally only one place you can get this one thing and you can get, you can't get any of the others there and you can't get that one thing any other place, I'm gonna, I'm gonna link you to like as few pages. This is like, get just a few packages as possible. Thank you, Amazon. Um, but, uh, sometimes it did work out. Um, but I try cause it's just easier. Now, what I will say is shit disappears, is not available and goes away. I do not update these posts. So if you find in the future, like if you watch this in future land and you're like, I couldn't get it there. I mean, by all means, leave a comment and you know, I'll look into it, but I'm not going to go back. Cause I share these things. Like it's like, there's a stash cast every week. There's a, um, art hall or a hall of some kind every week, generally speaking. Yeah, <laughs> no, not going to do it. I can't, it's not, it's not realistic to update that kind of thing. Um, so yeah, now I got to tell you, what, what are they, come on, what are they used for? What, are, what they're used for pom poms. Come on. See, there's one right there. Oh goodness. There we go. See, this is why I have pictures of things. That's a, that's like a little tree made with a pom pom, which is actually kind of fucking adorable. Um, so yeah, so yeah. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. I'm just looking. I, apparently I've never looked at the back of this. Oh, nice. They all have little things. Cool. Anyway, so they used to make pom-poms. Now around the time that I bought these, um, I guess making pom-poms was still like super in. More importantly, more importantly, uh, I was hanging out with a bunch of, uh, black doll makers. Um, one of which is Aniqua Wilkerson of my kind of thing. Hi, Aniqua! Um, and yes, black doll makers, that entire phrasing is important. Thank you very much. If you're new here, don't at me. Don't fucking do it. You won't like my response. Um, and that's because representation fucking matters. And for those of you who don't know, I am actually black and Hispanic. I'm triple dipped in fucking vanilla. Thanks, mom. The, you know, the conversations that my mother and I would have right now, if she were still alive, oh, they would be oh, interesting. I, I don't know that they would be good. I gotta tell you, I'm not one to back down. I don't care who you are, by the way. I don't care who you are. I will, I will come for you if you come at me shit. So yeah. Yeah. I love you, mom. Anyway, anyway, it's important. Representation matters. Now I'm real light skinned. Can't do anything about it. And I'm not going to use that phrase that people like to use. Cause I fucking hate that phrase. I'm not even gonna tell you what it is. Cause I hate it. 
I have like trauma surrounding that because I had an ex who used to use that phrase as their reasoning basically for being an asshole, <laughs> which means every time I hear it, I kind of want to like break things unless it's a negative reaction to me. Don't you just love our random conversations? We're talking about pom-poms. What comes up? Being black and trauma. Okay. Hey, look, this is part of why you're here, though. Like, seriously, if you can't get down, you don't need to be here. As my mentor says, ejection seats are wonderful. Get thee gone if you can't hang. No skin off my back. So, um, about these. Aniqua was, she'd been making dolls for a while, I would say, definitely. She has significantly like a larger amount of doll designs and things that she's doing now. Um, but one of the things that she was doing, she was making a ballerina with a puff, right? Afro puff. Well, the Afro puff was made with one of these. I mean, not necessarily this one, although it might've been this one. I don't, I don't actually know. Iniqua, if you would, sugar snaps. If you'd like to chime in and let us know, please do. Um, and at one point she was doing classes. Um, I don't know if she's still doing classes, but she was doing classes at the time or shortly after. And one of them was a pom, -com, pom, pom class, which I took. Um, I gotta be honest with you. I still suck at it. Her class is great. I just can't seem to wrap my head around using these bad ones, <laughs> which is why all the ones that I've made that are like samples, I think I've used one of these or one of these, one of the little, little ones so that I didn't have to sacrifice a lot of yarn to the cause. This is going to kill me. I have no idea where those pom poms are. Like I see them in my head. I made a bunch and I'm just like, where are they? And I'm like, that's a fucking great question. I have no idea. So mad. So mad. Now, by the way, that I've been talking about this, I totally want to make a whole bunch today. I have other videos to record. I don't have time to do that. I want to, though. Okay. Okay. So, um, I had to get all the sizes. I like clover. I have, um, hold on. Hold on. It's on. It's on. It's, on. it's all of it. Oh my gosh. I have a, I have a whole bunch of other stuff by Clover. Like these crochet hooks. And this, this pen, this, this doesn't belong. But yeah. Um, all the larger sizes of the crochet hooks that are not typically in sets. Those are by Clover too. I love those. I've also got their steel hooks and their regular metal ones too. And by regular, I mean the commonly used sizes that are metal, right? Those are plastic. Anyway, I saw them and I was like, I need to make these. And I was like, I don't make dolls. Doll making is like on my list of things that I would like to get into. Um, and I, it's not that I don't make dolls. Like I've never made a doll. I have made, I've made a, a cute, a uh, couple of dolls, but the dolls I tend to make are like, uh, furry or animal or, um, like witch related. So I made, uh, I've made two goddess dolls, which were knit by the way. Um, and I made a frog doll. It was actually a doll. It was, I'm trying to think of her name. It's Lolly Lolly Lala. I don't know. I don't fucking know. I'm really bad. I'm really bad with remembering things sometimes. So let's see. Um, we're gonna, we're gonna make a note. It might not have been Lolly Lala. It's a doll like that though. Okay. Anyway, I'm going to link to appropriate people. <laughs> so I made, actually made a frog doll for a friend of mine who loves frogs. So I saw this frog doll and what I decided, like the, I think the dolls are meant to be like made in a smaller yarn. So I made it in worsted, which by the way, ended up making this doll like freaking yay doll. <laughs> And it's cute. So what it is, the doll is dressed up in like a frog suit. And I decided to make it a frog in a frog suit. 
Yeah, you heard me right. So, like, the frog suit is dark green, but the skin tone is, like, a real pale green. And it's got little boop on the top of the eyes, and it's got a little tiny bow, little red bow, um, that I made. That I think might be... I don't know who's... I don't know whose pattern it was. I don't know. I'd have to look it up. I have no idea now that I think about it. And I made her a little scarf, too. And it's red. So the scarf and the thing is... Um, oh, and I made a little heart, too. Um, it's, it's fucking cute. And now I'm just, and then I decided, I'm like, you made, like, a really big one. Do you want to make um, a really small one? And I'm like, I kind of do. <laughs> yeah, like, I think these... Um, I think these dolls are, like, meant to be made out of, like... It's like... I don't know, DK or sport yarn. And I made mine out of worsted. I really want to make one out of um, a super bulky yarn. I think that would be really fun. I also don't want to know the price tag of that doll because it's going to take so much yarn to do. But I want to make one. I have this thing about wanting to make really large things and really small things. <laughs> this is this is, this is is why, right? Um, by the way, I got to tell you, I don't think that these are easier to use. I really don't. I think, like, the big one probably is easy enough to use. Um, I know this isn't a review. I'm just commenting from trying to use these things. And I would say it's easy to use because it's more surface area, but it's harder to use because it's more surface area. These are probably, like, money right here. Right here. These are the ones that are probably the easiest to make um, because they're not – it's not – if you've ever made a pom-pom, you know exactly what the hell I'm talking about. There's just, there's a degree of finesse to it that, like, makes your pom-pom turn out, like, just right. Which is why I took, um, Nico's class, because I could not, could not figure it out on my fucking own. Big surprise there. So, anyway. 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 So, um, she was making, um, ballerinas. That's what, like, a lot of what she was making. And then you just puff. And I was like, oh my god. I, while I want to make a doll and I think it'd be really fun to make a doll and it'd be awesome to make a black doll. Um, because when I was growing up, my mother had a black doll. She, her mother made her a black raggedy Ann doll because they don't make black raggedy Ann dolls. And so her mother made her one so that she had a black doll like her. And so for me, like, that's important. That is super important. And while I am super light skinned and so I don't personally have the doll that looks like me is for a skin tone. I do have the doll that looks at me like me with a hair problem. Like that's, I have curly hair and most dolls don't. They have, um, straight hair. It might have a slight wave to it. It's nothing to write home about. And it's, it, it, uh, represent, representation matters. And that's part of why I love all these, uh, black doll makers. They, because black hairstyles are so intricate and so wonderful. And they have so much history and story behind them and meaning. And look, I'm not saying that there's anything wrong with having straight hair, but I can't identify. I can't relate to that. I don't fucking have straight hair. And when I straighten my hair, it's, it honestly doesn't feel great. It doesn't feel great. It feels like I'm toning down a, a part of myself to, you know, suit somebody else. So I don't, I don't much care for it. Like I have done it in the past, essentially for that reason. Um, not a fan. So now it's not how we roll. Yay. Growth. <laughs> But, you know, the, the knots and the braids and, like, the puffs and the giant puffs and the, the, you know, twists and bantu knots and all the specific hairstyles, they're just they're awesome. They're great. They're fantastic. And they're so much fun. It's just, it's like, so lovely to see. And, yeah. Deal with it. Anyway. So. I was like, well, I wouldn't. Like, I'm not going to get into doll making because that's not my, that's not really my shtick, right? Uh, which may or may change, right? Hey, you're, you're an artist. You're allowed to grow and evolve. Um, but I do love the concept of the pom-pom, right? And so then I saw these. These were just cute. These were just cute. Um, 
And honestly, I'm probably not going to use this as much because this is a much, um, this is a much lower tech way. So, um, just like, um, not a tutorial because this is not a tutorial, but just like a heads up on how this is used, which you do is you wrap like this, you wrap around and you wrap around, you know, until you've gotten whatever surface area and you want it even, right? You want it as even as possible and nice and neat. Um, and then you take another strand around here and you tie it and you pull it tight as fuck. That's one of the, that's, that's one of the keys to this is making this even and then tying this super tight because what you do is then you cut these sides, just these on this, these ends on this, you're, I mean, it tells you how to do it, but right. You're cutting along where you've wrapped and that's after tying it. And, um, then a lot of people trim them. Um, the reason why Aniqua's was so awesome is because she had like perfected the how to and the exact technique so that like cutting was not like really a thing. Um, like every, every tutorial I've seen on the internet as you cutting them. Um, that said, if I can find, I reached out to Nico already. If I can find a link to where she has it shared, if she's sharing it, it will be there. If I can't, um, I'm going to try and share the, the ballerina doll because she's got an Afro puff and there's a possibility it's there. Um, and even if it's not there, doll pattern, buy it, make doll. Mm -hmm. It's the right thing to do. It's Sunday. Do it. <laughs> anyway. Um, yeah. Gosh, I'm, this is a video is like, all okay. I figured out what just happened. Sorry. What happened was, um, I have too much stuff on my phone. So yeah. So what's going to happen is there's going to be this weird, ooh, and that's going to be me having edited the video enough to put the two videos together. So we're just going to continue on what the fuck we were doing. Anyway. Um, so you can use these for all kinds of things. I personally am going to be focusing on using these as like scrap usage. Um, and the reason for that is that, right. Cause messages and intentions and styles and, and like where you go with your work, right. Changes, right. Changes, changes. It's a thing. It's natural. It's weird. Evolution. So what's that? Anyway. So. So. Um. Brain just stopped. God damn it. Why? Okay. Let's see if I can get this. Um. One of the directions that my art has been going is to one, it's first of all, it's fucking colorful. Okay. I I've, I've, I think I've told the story a couple of times where, um, I've had people say, wow, your work is so colorful. And I was just like, yeah, no, it is now that, now that you bring it up, <laughs> I just don't think about it. And I guess I don't think about it because what's your girl doing right here? Fucking gray, fucking black, fucking gray and black. I, I wear a lot of black and a lot of dark gray, preferably dark gray, but I do have some light gray. Hello, Severin Cardigan. Shout out, shout out to Vanessa. See, look, this is what happens. I think of all these things and I try to, I try to add stuff in as I think about it. Anyway, um, my work tends to be really colorful and statement pieces. Ah! A little Stephen Westish, like maybe a step below that. Like his work is like, wow, which is great, which is lovely. Um, and like goals. Like if you see a Stephen, if you see a West Nitz, you know, it's Stephen West, you know, it's Stephen West. If you know anything about anything, even if I showed you like 
10 different things and like a couple of them were by Stephen West, you could probably say, this is probably the same designer. I'm going for that. That's what we're trying to do over here is um, cohesion, uh, coherence, as my mentor would say, in, in like what we're doing. Because, I mean, yeah. So anyway, um, color is a really big thing. Another big thing of uh, what I do Emily just had to throw her two cents in there is using scraps and repurposing and recycling and upcycling. Um, that figures very heavily into my work and it didn't like, so in, you know, facts, it didn't at the beginning. Um, it's not that it didn't have the potential to be the beginning. I was just focusing on doing new things for the most part. Now I will say the thread of it was there at the beginning of my work because I'd use a lot of remnants. Like I am team use everything. Um, because waste not want not and the trauma of being poor and having to make shit last <laughs> not something i'm thankful for knowing by the way but useful skill so it's okay i guess <laughs> cries and existential dread so anyway um that's the thing but um I want to make stuff with like, I want to do things like that because I don't know it like, because it matters. I just got an idea. Hold on. Hold on. Post it. I might post it so far away. This is what happens. This is actually, so if you want to know about my creative process and like how I get ideas, this shit being honestly, honestly, being ADHD is probably how I get all of my ideas, shit randomly pops in my fucking head. And I'm like, that sounds great. And then it's like, bitch, are you going to remember that? Oh no. Oh no. No, 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 no. That's for you, friends. <laughs> oh man. There's so many, I have, I'm full of little stories and a little, and a little alternative monikers for things and memes and gifs and 90s kid references and song lyrics and movie quotes and yeah this that's what goes on anyway so before i forget uh oh my god my pen is dead it died is that friend oh no oh no oh no come here you don't worry i got a cup thank you joyce i have a cup on my desk of just like random other pens because my lamp that has a caddy, hello, hot light. Um, yeah. Uh, yeah, I, we're going to share that too. If I can, if I can, if I can find it, remember anyway, before I forget what I was doing. Ooh. We're going to do some experimenting today. <laughs> okay. It's really bad. Is that one, two, three, four, five words scribbled, a really bad diagram on that post. -it. The question is when I, if I look at that in a week, am I going to know what the hell that says? Maybe. Maybe. Anyway. 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 So, um, yeah. But using scraps is like, I've always used remnants. So, um, this includes, um, getting thrifted amounts of yarn sometimes. Yeah. Hot tip. You can randomly find yarn in thrift stores. <laughs> I'm not going to say that you can find good yarn in thrift stores. Okay. I'm not going to say that you're going to find yarn you want to use like for really nice things in thrift stores, but you can totally find yarns in thrift stores. I actually had an, an ex-boyfriend. He was, he was trying to be helpful. Bless his heart. Um, I've had that happen a couple times. Like people 
people I was involved with tried to like be supportive and helpful, but had no idea what they were doing. And it was like, you were, you're trying so hard, sweetie. That's, that's real nice that you're trying. You probably should have asked me and I could have like given you a little bit of advice. Like, bitch, I don't need surprises. Okay. I need something done right. And look, 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 I will give them credit. Sorry, it's bothering the crap out of me. I will give them... What? What is going on? What are you doing? What are you... <sighs> curls, y'all. Curls. Uh, I'll give them credit for for trying. For, like, helping. For, like, making an attempt. It's, yeah, no. Props for making an effort. Um, but if I'm not, like thrilled one i have anhedonia because i deal with a uh, major depression and so i don't necessarily outwardly get really excited and so if you don't know me you don't know what my excited looks like and so you just think that oh she just doesn't care and i'm like no that's really cool and everybody's like oh and i'm like whatever <laughs> whatever y'all um Anyway, anyway, um, so yeah, so, so yeah, <laughs> I'm having the time. I am having a time today, but that's, bes be bes beside the point. Um, uh, but yeah, using things, scrap, um, Remnants I actually recently got another idea to do like strips of fabric and like some patchwork ideas that I'm like super excited about doing. Like I have so much stuff to do this weekend and I would really, really, really like to get to some of this stuff because I have been itching to make. I have not been creating a lot lately because and it's it's honestly it's slowly fucking killing me inside like of all the things that are breaking me down and making me just say fuck everything that's at the that's taking the cake for what's just detrimental to my health okay so anyway um yeah oh, gosh i think that's everything i think that's i think that's everything i could possibly say plus a bunch of other shit that has nothing to do with anything This is also my social hour. <gasps> I have snacks. I'm hungry. Can I have snacks now? How about a crostata? Like, it's like a pie thing, but it's open. It's like bread bowl meets pie. Super excited. I have an apple one and a berry one. And I'm, I'm feeling that. I think I'm feeling the apple one this morning. So, yes. All right. Pompo makers. Two different, two different types. Bottom. Two sets bottom. Yay. Um, I haven't done a whole lot. And uh, here's the thing. If I today can figure out <laughs> where the hell the pom-poms I made. Like, look, I have not made that many pom-poms. I grabbed some scrap yarn. I got is either this set or this size. I feel like it had to have been this one, and I think it was, I think it was this one. Um, if I can find it, I will pick, I will put them in there, but otherwise you're just going to see these. So, sorry and shit. I just, it's, it's, and it, look, it's killing me because I'm realizing that I have no idea no idea where they are and like I can see where they were in the house that I used to live in like I, I know how my office was set up I know like I had a I had my calendar like the wall is here it was right there and they were hanging from it because I was all like excited about it because while they were kind of sad looking I was like I made a thing because that's that's what happens <laughs> It's when you make a thing. And when I moved, I packed everything up. And after, you know, when you move, you get tired after a point. You're just like, fuck it. Just throw shit in the box. I'm done. I don't know where those went. And it is killing me. Because I'm just like. The fuck did you do with them? And I'm like, that is a great question. 
question. I have no earthly clue. So anyway, if I can find them, I'll link them. Um, okay. So, so, all right, here we go. <laughs> My question for you is, do you have any of the ones by Clover or these? Do you have these? Do you have these? Do you have these? Have you used them? Do you like them? How do you like them? Um, got another idea. I'm sorry. Write this down. Let's see. Okay. Um, also, if you don't have these, I know like Lion Brand has a set. I've seen them. They, it looks strange because it just looks like circles and I'm just looking at it like, I don't understand how this works. Um, or any other, like other people have these. It's, it's you know, <sighs> these are the ones I like Clover. So I like uh, at least, um, but if you have them, how do you like them? Have you used them? If you want to share what you've made with them, please by all means share. I don't, I don't know if you can like do anything other than post a comment on YouTube or my Patreon, but you can, I mean, you can always post it to Instagram and like tag me. I, I hate being tagged by the way. Like I hate being tagged, but you know, if you make a pom pom with this, or I decide to make pom poms with these. Yeah, I want to see. Cool. Yay. Um, speaking of ins speaking of Instagram. <laughs> so linked below. Okay. All right. What do we got? Because we got a bunch of links. We got like a lot of links. Lots of lots of links. So um, I'm gonna link you to my blog because I mentioned it. So if you would like to see how fucking long winded I am over there, and know that nah. Now this is like a thing. This is how we do things here. You can head over there. Just a warning. It has been a while. It has been a while since I have blogged. Um, also linked Aniqua of my kind of thing. Um, I'm linking her Instagram because that's where I hang out the most. And I like pretty pictures. And mm. uh, Also, I don't have her pom-pom class linked. As of, let's see, I'm going to look at my, hold on. Um, okay. Sorry. Let me see if I can find. I sent. I sent her a message. I have no messages from her. Okay. Sorry. I've had like people. I've had, some, I've had like people in my inbox. And I, I could, I could, oh my god, this is so cute. Sorry. Um, I've, I've had people in my inbox. I'm going to leave it at that. He don't belong in my inbox. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So I'm just like, what the fuck is this? And what do you want? Go away. So, 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 uh, what else we got? Uh, oops, that's the wrong thing. No, that's the wrong thing. This is the right thing. Okay. I'm, I'm trying to go through the post and see what else I got here. I don't have the pom pom class linked. I will go ahead and link her uh, ballerina doll though, because there's a chance that she at least mentions it. Um, I'm also going to link Yolanda's um, Afro Puff keychain because she's going to talk about it there. And like, shout out to my to 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 my sis, like both y'all. So, um, let's see. And I'm like making sure. Okay. So also, um, I mentioned the frog doll. I'm going to, I'm going to link to the frog doll 
I'm going to link to the other designer if it's not the same designer. I think it's the same designer, but I'm beginning to realize that I'm not actually fucking sure. Um, and I'm going to link to my frog doll so that you can, you can see these things. Um, and it's Aniqua Dolls Yolanda. That's the order. So yeah, I know I skipped around a bunch. Um, and the reason I'm doing this is I, I mentioned it and it's just, um, it's, I know it's easy when I uh, ramble into oblivion to forget all the things I said. So we just shortcut it and say, hey, I've mentioned these things you want to see them. This is also why I have a copy like under the description box. It, it's not a transcript. Oh dear God, no. I, oh. I don't pity people, but I would have so much pity for the person who had to do transcripts in my videos. I won't do them. They're fucking random. And if I'm going to do a transcript, that shit, that shit is going to be word for word. I mean, word for word. Even the weird, awkward pauses and oh, <laughs> makes noise of frustration. Like, that shit's going to happen because is it an accurate transcript if that shit's not there? No, damn it, it's not. So. <laughs> Makes face. Anyway. Foolishness. That's what's going on. It's fucking Sunday. It's Sunday. It's Sunday, y'all. I stepped on my pencil. I'm upset about it. Anyway. This is what happens when I put stuff in my, like, front pockets and then, like, lean over because I have to pick something up off the floor and it's like, oh, just like now, drop the pencil. And then, hey, don't realize it. Crunch. Damn it. Okay, so anyway. Anyway. Um, I'm also going to see if I can find my outlight for the caddy because I love this thing. Love this thing. <laughs> now, lastly, lastly, I've also got links to all of these at the time that I am saying this, I'm looking and I'm not seeing the other one. Um, and I'll tell you what, oh my God, I, I just saw something I needed though. Who let me on the internet? Was it you? Anyway, so like, sometimes you will randomly see vendors have things and then you go poof. And I'm looking, I'm, fi I'm finished. I got like four pages and I'm on page three of the four. And I'm trying to see if I can find this thing, but I, I don't have, I don't have a lot of, um, I don't, I don't have a lot of hope because Theoretically, if I was going to find this, I should have seen this. I should have seen it on the first page. Okay. Seriously. Um, I got one more page to look through. Apparently. Oh, this is because this must be because Xmas. Uh, there's fucking garlands of pom poms, which is silly. I mean, decoration is decoration, but hey, that's that's something you can do with pom poms. You can make a garland <laughs> or bunting, but with pom poms instead. Okay, hold on, hold on. I got one more page. We got one more page. I don't think I'm gonna find it though. I'm gonna be honest with you. If it wasn't on the first page, I feel like it's not gonna be on the fourth page. But I found some other shit on the on the other pages that I'm like. Ooh. No. Mm. Taupe is a terrible word. I hate that word. Mm -mm. No, I'm not seeing it. How to make a pom pom plier. What? I don't understand. Is that brioche? It looks brioche. Who let me on the internet? It's either brioche or it actually might be brioche, but it might also be 
That is weird. Okay. No. So the answer is no. There is no link to the other one, so my bad. Um, I tried. <laughs> I tried. Sort of. Kind of. Mostly. So here's the thing. Um, yeah. I'm going to link to all the clever ones. So you can, you can find them. Now we're going we're gonna to go do this thing over here. Finish, finish our outro. <laughs> so I've linked to all those things. If you want to see them, they're linked. The good thing is they are hyperlinked in Patreon. If you go into, if you watch this on YouTube, it's like they're there. They're just like, I don't think it, it, it will hyperlink a link that's in link form, but you can't hyperlink text, um, to my knowledge at this point may change in the future. It'd be great if it did, but like, what else? Um, also linked below my websites, <laughs> Herodes and Janice Divine, where you can like pay me to do stuff for you or make stuff for you. Not anything, not everything, just some stuff, but cool stuff. Um, So excited about that. We're wrapping this up. Also, Facebook and Twitter and Instagram, where I hang out the most, are linked below. And because you stayed till the end, what we got here? What's tomorrow? What's tomorrow? Tomorrow is the 22nd. Tomorrow we're going to do Monday Motivation. Um, like it's been, it's probably going to be an audio. The Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Oh, the Friday sometimes can be, can be video. Um... I guess sometimes so can Wednesday, but like, actually they could all be. Anyway, I'm probably going to focus on making like the Monday, Wednesday, Fridays audios. Um, Tuesday and Sundays, I'm probably going to try and keep video, but if shit happens and things get weird, like, and I think the, I think the rule is going to be, I will try to record video once. If it does not record, I will switch over to audio because I am not trying to give myself a fucking fit because I'm not about that life. Um, yeah. <sighs> I said it. Um, Thursdays will be video when I'm able to do it. But for the foreseeable future, I eat until I replace my, my tripod, it's going to be audio because I can't, I can't work and hold the, the phone. Like, tripod was necessary. And like, look, I have another one. I don't know what happened to it. I think I broke that one too. I don't know how either. I probably did though. Um, so yeah, there you go. Now, thanks for being here. Thanks for hanging in here. This was a really long and very random and very tangent filled video. Talked about all kinds of stuff that has nothing to do with pom poms, but Hey, whatever. My brain found it to be related. So there you go. You're welcome. Um, remember, if you're watching this on YouTube, to like and subscribe. And like, if you know somebody who else need, who needs a dash of random art and other stuff in their life, send them here. Send this video to them. And what you should both do is hit the link at the top and come over to Patreon and become a patron. So like, I talk about my art here. Um... And I haven't actually said this, and I, 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 like this, I haven't said this, but this is to be like understood, I guess. I'm not going to put any of my audio. I just got huffed at y'all. I'm not going to put any of my audio only up here because, well, I think technically you can do that. No, just. No. So what's going to happen is if it's video, it'll make it over here to YouTube and Patreon. If it is only audio, it will only be on Patreon. Um, and a lot of times in the, the, you, you heard the backup plan is there's some things like, uh, the Sabbath cast, the Lunar cast, the Celtic cast are all going to be audio from now on. They, there's just no reason for them to be visual. Um, I'm probably going to start doing the ask me anything responses audio unless actually, no, I'm probably going to just do them audio and just have a picture in the cup and if the picture is necessary. Um, 
most things are probably going to be audio, which means it's over on YouTube. The postings are going to sparse out because I'm just, because they are, but I'm still on Patreon. So come, come over here. Join us. Join us. It's going to be fun. Yeah. Sure. Sure. It will. <sighs> And also, you know, seeing my face is probably far less interesting than listening to my voice. Or at least it's far less pleasant. Although it might be more amusing. I don't know. I'm not watching these videos. Like, you, you no. No. Anyway. So, become a patron. Just, just come over there. Just come, come on. Come on. Um, know that becoming a patron means that you get access to things that I don't post anywhere else and that are behind a paywall. Which it would be all of my, you know... Um, a lot of my community oriented magics and some exclusive one-on-one -on -one time, like when it comes to creative projects or picking my brain or other stuff like that. So that's, that's the place to do it. Yeah. And, uh, be on the lookout for craft dates. I am be bopping around with how to sort them out. The idea it's on a post-it in my planner somewhere. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> so that's going to be a thing. And I'm going to have, I'm going to have gatherings where they're public and I'm going to have more concentrated things where if you like want to hang out with me and have as much of my undivided attention as you're going to get if we're just hanging out and um, talking art and I'm possibly just rambling at times and answering questions. Yeah. Those will, yeah, those are things. So, 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 so I'm going to go. I gotta go. I gotta, I gotta, now I gotta put all these fucking videos together. Good luck with that. <laughs> Damn it. Okay. So, so long, farewell, to Sane, and goodbye, and I will see you bright-eyed and bushy-tailed tomorrow to hopefully still be fucking motivated. I could, I gotta tell you, I had such high hopes that I was gonna record this video and then the next two and get them done and then do some other videos and... I don't know right now. I really don't. <laughs> so I gotta go.